On August 22nd, Ambassador Simon tried to break that log jam, as he put it, regarding both the security assistance hold and the White House meeting. Ambassador Sondland described those efforts in his public testimony. Let's listen to him again. In preparation for the September 1 Warsaw meeting, I asked Secretary Pompeo whether a face-to-face -face conversation between Trump and Zelensky would help to break the logjam. And this was when President Trump was still intending to travel to Warsaw. Specifically, on August 22nd, I emailed Secretary Pompeo directly, copying Secretary Ed Kenna. I wrote, this is my email to Secretary Pompeo. Should we block time in Warsaw for a short pull aside for POTUS to meet Zelensky? I would ask Zelensky to look him in the eye and tell him that once Ukraine's new justice folks are in place in mid-September, that Zelensky, he Zelensky, should be able to move forward publicly and with confidence on those issues of importance to POTUS in the U.S. Hopefully that will help break the logjam. The secretary replied, yes. Sondland also explained that both he and Secretary Pompeo understood that issues of importance to the president were the two sham investigations the president wanted to help his re-election efforts. And that reference to the logjam meant both the security assistance and the White House meeting. At the end of August, National Security Advisor John Bolton arrived in Ukraine for an official visit. Ooh, David Holmes took notes in Ambassador Bolton's meetings and testified about Ambassador Bolton's message to the Ukrainians.